feminine for my bed but um i just want to say yeah so i've been gone for a little bit of time i've been in and out trying to do content um so i'm looking to get back into doing more content so comment down below with things you would like to see please comment like subscribe um if you're new to my channel i am an army wife my husband has been in the army for about a year well almost a year now um so we just moved to our first city station um so we don't really have family around here um so i just been feeling sick here and there um yeah i've been feeling like really tired really sick so a little backstory of how i found out i was pregnant um so i was we went to a bridal shower everything was fine uh two weeks after that i took a test it said negative so i was like okay maybe i'm just feeling sick for i'm just feeling sick maybe it's just like a stomach bug or something so then um recently like three days ago i was like feeling like really tired sick but like i had to throw up and i would cry every t i would cry for no reason like i could be watching youtube or anything and i just start crying so i was like that's a sign that i'm pregnant i guess so i took it as a sign and i went to the store and got a pregnancy test i took it like thinking it was gonna be negative because i mean i took a test like two weeks ago and it was negative so i took it to see what it was and surely enough it was positive which we are wanting more kids we want like four or five but right now we're on two um we're gonna see how this goes <laughs> um i know that two two under two can be a lot um so i'm gonna try my hardest to like be the best mom i can be um try to be the best mom i can be i know sometimes i'm gonna get overwhelmed and tired but that's just what comes with being a mom but yeah so i found out like two three days ago and now we are on our six weeks i'm six weeks pregnant in like a day i think but i have appointment set up in two weeks because everything is booked up so like there's no appointments up until up until now so there's no appointments so it's like all booked up so they the quickest time they can get me in is in two weeks it's just in june which is fine um so i'm hoping everything is go good i will take you guys with me on that to like let you guys see the behind the scenes and stuff like that but um i'm very excited i hope that we have a girl but if i'm a boy mom that's fine too but i'm really hoping for a girl i just want to experience experience being a girl mom because i'm a boy mom and i love my son um but i just want to experience both you know because i do want to like get to experience loving my daughter like i would want i would want that when i was younger you know so i just want to experience that maybe heal some things but other than that um we're excited we already have the girl name picked out we've been having her name picked out for a while the boy name we were like stuck on if it should start with the k because kaisen names start with the k but we're not sure so we don't really know if um my camera is like wacky we don't really know if um we're gonna name our son with the k still um yeah so comment down below any like video suggestions you want to see um besides my pregnancy um i will be getting the house finished up because you know we moved here two months ago i will be getting the house all finished up that way i can um have everything organized when baby gets here the baby will have his or her own room um i will do a nursery like i did for kyson um i don't think i'm doing a baby shower just because family is like so far away i might just do um i don't know what i'm gonna do yet but i know i'm doing we're doing a gender reveal we're gonna do like the cake gender reveal i don't know if you guys seen that before where they do like the little wine cake thingy wine glasses and cake that's what we're gonna do for gender for our gender reveal which we'll find out when i'm 14 weeks um yeah so i'm hoping everything goes good with this pregnancy um praying that you know the baby's healthy and i'm praying that everything's go good go 
ghost good because I am the type of mom that stresses over everything. I'll go to the hospital for the littlest thing. So hopefully this one is different from the first one because I was like really stressing out the first one. But hopefully this one's different and I'll be okay and everything will go good. I am kind of nervous being a mom too. I'm kind of nervous, but I feel like they would be the best of friends. And Kyson is, he's not a hard baby. He just spoiled, like, he's really spoiled. But I think they would get along really good. I feel like they would get along really good. Because Kyson is a sweet baby, but he is spoiled. So, but that's about it. So, yeah, I'm excited. And I just wanted to share, you, share this with you guys because um, I feel like you guys, you know, you've seen a lot. Of my videos you've seen a lot of my you've seen a lot of it so i just want to include this too because this is a big part of my life as well my kids will forever be the big part of my life so i wanted to share it with you guys um i'm excited for all the little baby stuff and you know getting the house together all kinds of stuff i'm excited for what's to come this year even though i won't have the baby till january but we'll still be able to you know, like, ha Kyson's going to have a good birthday. And the year is going to go by so fast, hopefully. Because nine months is a long time. But I hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And continue watching this video. Sorry for the little rant. But I thought I would include this. So that way you guys have a little backstory. And it's not short. The video is not too short like it is. <laughs> but I will be back and better with more content. So thank you guys for being patient with me and, you know, tuning into my videos and commenting and just, you know, watching. Even if you're a silent watcher and you don't like or comment, I still appreciate you for watching my videos. Okay, so now I'm about to take a test. Um, oh. So now I'm about to take a test. I already took a pregnancy test um, two, three, three days ago. So I wanted to do it on camera so you, that way you guys can see. So here's the pregnancy test I'm about to take for you guys on camera. As you can see, it doesn't have anything on there yet. So I'm gonna take this, um, I'm gonna take this test and come back. I just wanna show you guys a result. I want you to see like a real life, real time result. So I want to show you guys on camera of the test. So I'm going to take this test and come back and show you guys the results. Camera roll, camera roll. Here's the results. As you can see, pregnant. So yeah. If you're wondering where I have been, I've been sick. I'm trying to get my life together because we're having a new baby. Um, my hair is a little messy. Look at all my hair. Um, I do have a doctor's appointment set up already, so I'll take you guys along with that. But that's in the middle of June, so right now we're not in the middle, we're just finished with May, so the appointment should be here soon. But I hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below what you guys think I'm having. Is it a boy? Is it a girl? I do have a son, so. And that's my first child. So let me down, copy down below what you guys think I'm going to have. Um, I will be vlogging my pregnancy a lot more this time. So stay tuned for the videos. But I just wanted to go ahead and get that secret out to you guys. Hope you like, comment, and subscribe for more. Thank you. Mm -hmm.